Hi guys, remember my garden pizza oven project? Well, it's being finished up. The concrete is becoming seasoned. So pretty soon we'll be able to fire it up and bake our first pizza. And for that, we've got two gadgets, temperature sensors, an analog one and a digital one. So let's check out what's inside. So as you can see, and just let's put it this way so there's no reflections. Temperature range up to 500 or maybe rather 600 degrees centigrade, 1000 Fahrenheit should be sufficient for our pizza oven. Mountable, probably on the pizza oven door. Of course you can do without a thermometer. So how do you recognize the temperature is okay? You fire it up and once the suit on the roof of the oven starts burning up and disappears, that means the temperature is correct. But let's see how the digital one looks. Infrared thermometer. Okay, so this is how it looks. Paid 12 bucks. Some might laugh saying, well, you can buy one like this for only eight bucks, you overpaid. But take, look, take a look at the temperature range. 1,112 degrees Fahrenheit or 600 degrees centigrade. The cheap ones that you can buy for eight bucks go up to 300, maybe 400 degrees. So that's the difference. You're paying for the temperature range that this is capable of measuring. You can pay 30 bucks for one going up to something like 900 degrees centigrade, but that would be an overkill in a pizza oven because it'll probably be difficult to get it going even as high as 500 degrees. So 600 degrees temperature range is totally sufficient. Let's just see if we can get it working. I guess we need some batteries. Two AAA batteries. Twenty-three point three degrees centigrade. Let's see, thirty-two point three degrees centigrade. So it's not thirty-six point six as usual for a healthy adult. Of course, that's the surface of a palm of a hand, not your armpit. So I guess it should be okay. And let's see the analog one for comparison. It's not comparable because it starts at something like 100 degrees or 50 degrees centigrade. So it's definitely not capable of measuring room temperature. So let's see what functions we have here. You can switch on and off the display illumination, switch on and off the laser pointer, and switch between centigrade and Fahrenheit temperature measurements. So that's it for today. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and of course check out the other movie with a pizza oven. Soon we'll be firing it up and baking our first pizza.